Poland is sitting on a vast shale gas reserve and multinational energy companies are moving in to tap these fracking resources. Mr. Osicza, is the country on the way to its gas boom? Well, it remains to be seen. I think it's really to say that. I mean, by the way, Germany is also sitting on a vast uh, gas, shale gas reserves. And actually, some people say that uh, Germany has more shale gas reserves than Poland. But in the Polish case, we are at the beginning of the road. So I think it takes us another few years before we know whether we're going to be another Norway or not. Are the people in Poland afraid of the environmental risks too? Uh, in what sense? Regarding drinking water or soil? I think like everywhere, I mean, there, there are no particular reasons to be afraid of, especially that you have to be reminded of the fact that 20 years ago, I mean, Poland was a communist country. So whatever happened after 1989, there was an improvement of the quality of the environment. Yeah? So even if there are some uh, potential, uh, let's say, suspicions, yes, uh, that the environment might be, uh, not the environment is, uh, is regressing. I mean, still most of people believe, not only believe, they know, they feel it, just that the, the situation is now much better than it used to be 20 years ago. How do you feel the German energy event is observed in your country? Well, I don't know. First of all, uh, the main, let's say, the key issue is that we are discussing uh, things like energy event uh, on the European level. So it's not a situation which we have a national policies that are driving actually EU policies. Yes, that's first thing. Secondly, an energy vendor is not is not very much known in Poland, to be honest. I mean, among you know think tank communities, you know experts uh, from the industry, also from from uh, energy sector, they they know yes what energy uh, vendor takes and what is the the very idea, but the. The general impression is that Germany is phasing out nuclear plants, and that's it.